Hey folks, it's Dr. Baum, and I'm going to walk you through your next assignment, which will be to do your first reflection in the Pathway Manager website. Now, we use Career Cruising, and that's where you took all of your assessments, but now we're going to switch over to the Pathway Manager website. And the Pathway Manager site is where your career information will be held throughout your time at Greater Latrobe High School. So it is important that you do this because this will be your documentation of your career education while you are here. So the Google slide that is attached to this assignment is four slides and it walks you through the assignment. So it gives you the directions for each one of these. It gives you your questions. It gives you an example and it tells you how to go ahead and post these into Pathway Manager. I'm going to go ahead and walk you through that process now so that you can have a visual of it. So if I go back here, I have typed a Google Doc of my answers to the questions. Okay, I named it Reflection 1 Assessment Results. Four questions are asking you to reflect on the assessments you just took. So the My Matchmaker results. Did you get careers that you expected to get? Were you surprised by any of them? And explain what, you, what, you, what you're thinking about that. You, what about your My Skills results? Did you get letter scores that you expected? Were you surprised by any of that? And explain what you're thinking. And then the last one here about your learning styles inventory. Do you feel that your learning style fits you? Explain yourself. And then the careers that you researched or which career you researched and what you learned about that career and if you're if you are still interested in it. So those are your questions. So you're in your Google Doc, you're going to select everything, control A, you're going to copy everything, control C, and then you're going to follow the directions to get to Pathway Manager. So if you look right here, it's going these are exactly what I'm going to do to show you right now. So you're going to go to glsd.us I lied you're going to my glsd look at me I can't even follow my own directions there we go and you're going to go in the first column to pathway manager And you are going to log in as a student. And I'm hoping this works for me because it doesn't always work for me. So I may have to. Ah. Okay. So I figured out that the student activity account that they gave me to use as an example didn't work. So I had to break in as a student. So I'm not going to show you the top of the screen, but up here at the top of the screen, when you log in, you'll see your name and then it'll have a black bar where it says reflect, or you can simply hit this orange box right here that says reflect. Then you go to reflect upload and you are going to choose course exemplar and the title is reflection number one assessment whoops I spelled that wrong assessment results and then you will take that Google Doc that you copied control V you will paste it and it will show up right here and then you're going to skip and ignore all of these choose files and you're just going to hit submit and it will say your reflection has been submitted I will be able to see this automatically when I get into my teacher version of Pathway Manager. I can look all of you up by my class list. So once you have done that and you've submitted it, you can simply submit the assignment in Classroom and that will let me know to go and look for your reflection. So again, look at the attached Google slide. It gives you the directions, the questions you need to answer, an example and the directions for getting it into Pathway Manager. If you have questions, reach out to me. Um, look at my office hours that I have in the morning and in the afternoon and 
we will be able to help you finish up.